everybody. This is Allie and Sierra, and today is the first episode of Coffee with Allie. That's me. And Sierra and I will be, oh, I'm going to be interviewing people and I'm going to be like talking to different people about different aspects of photography during Coffee with Allie. Today Sierra is my first guest. She'll be kind of my second, probably my third guest, but eventually we will talk to other people too. And today we're going to talk about collaboration. Uh, Sierra is an amazing model and makeup artist. She makes me a better photographer. Aw, you make me a better makeup artist. Aw, see that's what we do. That's called collaboration, <laughs> see? Well that's actually called compliments, but... Yeah, whatever. So, Same thing, I guess, kind of. <laughs> Not really. Not really, no. <laughs> but, yeah. But so anyway, by collaborating with Sierra as a makeup artist, I'm able to bring visions and I'm able to bring things to forward. She's able to challenge herself more. And she's also got a great photographer, well, I think I'm a pretty decent photographer, that can pull her visions forward. So when you're collaborating, I, I just want to like think about like what does it mean as an artist to collaborate with another artist and you mean I mean photographers can collaborate with each other but in this case we are combining our skills into a complementary type of um, it's almost like a triforce whenever you include the you know the model, the model. and which is a huge part of our collaboration right uh, the other thing I think is is the idea who comes up with it. and sometimes right the model comes up with it yeah and, and yeah. we and we love when a model comes over and yes says hey would you like Natalie came over to came to this one was just me and Natalie. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Sierra. She did. Yeah, no, no. I know you would have been good though, but no, no, no. She, she did, does beautiful makeup though. She does. She does. She yeah. did Stepford Monster Wives. Yeah. Oh, we loved that shoot. It was so much fun. It was so good. And we and so it was her idea, and I liked it. So since I liked it, I supported it, and we shot it. Mm -hmm. It was like a collaboration with a model. Right. Collaborations can go a lot of ways, but I do really strongly believe. Mm -hmm that at least for me, I'm a better photographer when I collaborate with somebody and build off of those ideas. Yeah. When I too. just drive an idea, things go strange. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially, well, because sometimes you just need, uh, you need a sounding board to bounce things off of, right? You need to be able to, to chat, chat with that person. And I think that's why we collaborate so well together is because you are my sounding board and I'm your sounding board. And we're not For afraid. crazy things, yeah. right? For like, oh, is that going too far? <laughs> and like, we collaborate and we use Pinterest. Yeah. We're getting to the point now that we can't find what we're thinking of on yeah. Pinterest. This is getting a little frustrating because then I have to draw something or Sierra has to draw something and we can't draw. Yeah, we're really, well, I'm okay, but. I'm definitely not that great. <laughs> it's mostly stick figures, it's right? Stick figures. Yeah. But I mean, it gets our ideas across. Uh, we use uh, the, what are we using now? The Google Keep? Yeah. And yeah. I was using OneNote. To keep track of our ideas. And I feel like a lot of the time it's, it's because it's artists that inspire us, right? Mm -hmm. Like, you know, Lindsay Adler and... Frank Dorhoff. Right, exactly. And yeah. you've got your makeup inspira inspiration. Yeah, I do. I do have my makeup inspiration. I, oh gosh, I can't remember her name, but she's... The wigs and um, theater manager over in the UK. She's wonderful. She makes beautiful art, um, and she was the inspiration for the um, pottery ideas that we're going to be doing. Oh, those yeah, are yeah. yeah. And the thing that a lot of people don't know is Sierra's recently got an air airbrush, and so with the airbrush, the sky is going to be the limit. We can yeah. do some crazy stuff. It's going to be so much fun. So, but yeah. yeah, I mean, I think I think whenever we collaborate, it's clear communication, clear. making sure that we support each other. And whenever an idea doesn't work out or it doesn't sound good, it's coming to that person with an open mind and saying, uh, this is why I think this won't work out. What do you think? It's so Sierra, first, I think we're going to talk about a not so good collaboration. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, just whenever you do collaborate with somebody, I feel like communication is very, very important. Um, and I recently had a collaboration where I worked with, with a photographer. Um, they brought an idea to me and I thought I was going to have an artistic license. Um, so I started doing makeup sketches, which is pretty fairly normal for, for oh, any makeup normal. artist. Yes. And um, whenever I brought them to the photographer, they basically told me, oh, no, 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 no. I have a specific vision. Um, 
And I, I feel like that's why, you know, we work so well together is because there is a clear vision, there's clear communication. And I feel like that's really important whenever you work together, so. And another aspect to what Sierra is talking about is we're talking about portfolio building. We're not talking about a photographer that hired Sierra and right. paid her a bunch of money to do what she said. Right. So Sierra needs to get something out of this too. The model needs to get something out of this. Everybody that's helping should be getting something out of it, whether it's the experience, that they're learning something, they're getting part of their vision out there. So recently I came to Sierra with the Viking shoot. And I, we recently did a little bit of a video about that. And that was so much fun. But I had my ideas. We tend to develop our ideas on Pinterest. Yeah. I send her the Pinterest board. I'm like, Sierra, I want to shoot Liz. She's going to be like this badass Viking. And it was not good. It was not. She it didn't was, like I it. I didn't like any of the pins. It was sure. bad. It was like, it was like what people think a Viking woman should look like, which is very generic and like overdone. And I, so I immediately, you know, I'm always very open and honest with Allie. I told her, I said, I I didn't like it. Didn't <laughs> I don't like it, it and I don't want to do anything like that. Um, but we've done a lot of shoots together. Right. So I said to myself, okay, I certainly can't do <laughs> badass Viking makeup. I would wind up going outside getting some dirt and smearing it on her <laughs> face. I mean, I just wouldn't even know where to start. So I just gave Sierra a full creative license saying, look, I don't want a pretty Viking with perfect skin. I want her to look like she has been in battle. Right. I want her to look like she's you know, done things. And then Sierra went and created the beautiful work that you saw, which should be floating somewhere around our heads right now. <laughs> yeah, and I think the, what was great with, about that was like, I didn't even ever, I never came to you about that. It was no. just something that you and you were working on with Liz. I was working on it with Liz. It started right. off as a big hair, crazy woman project That's and turned right. into a Viking. Right, right. So then we have a future shoot that we're collaborating on and this one is Sierra's idea. Yeah, yeah. So we're we're going to be working on, um, there is a woman, um, her picture should be floating around here, but uh, <laughs> there, there is a woman um, who kind of inspired it all. Um, and I wanted to do like stained glass and um, something that was very unique. Um, a lot of the time she does Disney princesses and princesses are really not my thing. Um, not Allie's thing either. So, um, Sorry, princesses. You're lovely. Yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful lovely. dresses. Lovely. Just not my style. Yeah. Um, so I figured we'd do villains. Villains I like. Yes. Villains. villains Very exciting. Yes. So um, taking those villains, making them into stained glass. Um, and, you know, I feel like that was something that would work with Allie's style. It would work with my style. So we're going to be collaborating on that soon and working mm -hmm. everything out. I'm working on the makeup designs now and I always share them with her. And, you know, I think whenever we go through the process, that's another thing. I always ask for your input. Like, yep. will this look good with this lighting? Will this, you know, what kind of shot are you going to be doing for this makeup? So then I know exactly how much makeup I need to do, how far it needs to go down on the body, all of that. So... And also, if I'm using strobes versus natural light, she's going to, like, ask me these questions. Right. So that we can make sure that the makeup works. So, I had an idea that we could just do a quick collaboration right here, right now. Because... What? What? <laughs> yeah. I made a photo shoot idea generator. Okay. So, this is how it rolls. In one cup are like nouns of types of models we would shoot. Okay. In the other cup are little descriptive things of how we might shoot that person. So you pull from each one. What did you put in here? I don't know. But it, there are some that we have a right to say, no, we're not going to do that. We could do that. Okay. So, like, okay. Okay. So what'd you get? So I got kitty pool. Kitty pool warrior. Oh my god, a kitty pool warrior would be great. Do we want to collaborate on that? Sure. Let's okay. Do it. So I shoot in a kitty pool over the summer. Okay. Now we need a yeah. warrior. Okay, uh, so oh what if we did so that the warrior was like they were on a boat and they had fallen into the water 
Okay. And like they had arrows all in them. Yeah, 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 yeah. And they yeah, yeah, were yeah. like dying. And you shot that. And 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 I'll go into my yard and I'll get a bunch of old weeds and grass and stick that in the pool. Right. So this way it looks like a natural lake, even though they're really just in a kiddie pool. Right. I love that. Oh, we yeah. should really do that. Is it actually. a dude or is it a woman? We can never get good shirtless dudes. <laughs> a good shirtless dude would be perfect for this. Let's yeah. Uh, I mean, if we could get a dude. If but we could get a dude, if not, we'll just not, use one I mean, of our... We have lots of badass A lot women. of bad. Yeah, exactly. We have lots. Yeah, yeah, we have yeah. Lots. yeah. Okay. So, that's the uh, first conclusion of our very first coffee with Allie and Sierra. And we thank you for joining us. And um, if you enjoyed this... Please subscribe. Give us, throw us a like. Just throw us a like. It would be nice. We could use some likes. We could use some subscribes. And uh, we'll be doing more of this. And I hope you enjoyed it. And thank you for joining us. Bye, guys. <laughs> Start off. Okay. All right, we just crop and then keep going. We don't have to turn the thing off.